Captain Crunch here. I'd like to talk to you today about my new uh, Zebra Light headlamp. This is the model H52W. It's a fairly light headlamp with uh, uses a single AA battery, which I'll stick in there right now. This light is uh, very light. It's uh, the lamp itself is 31 grams. The headband is 25 grams, and the battery, of course, is like 15 grams if you use the uh, lithium batteries. The whole thing totals like 71 grams. It also comes with this little uh, pocket clip which pops off. I pulled it off. Uh, it weighs like 4 grams. And a couple of extra O-rings for the bottom seal here. The light is pretty neat. It's got a number of different modes of operation. It's fairly complicated actually. It has a low setting, a medium setting, and a high setting. And then each of those can be sub-programmed into a low and a high. It's also got a beacon strobe, a 4 hertz strobe, and a 19 hertz strobe. Uh, just poking at it here, if you click and hold the button, it'll cycle through low, medium, and high. So if you go to low, you can double click it, it'll do uh, the low low or the uh, medium low is what I have it programmed at right now. The low low is just barely enough to read by uh, in the dark and my camera doesn't pick it up so I won't try and demonstrate it in the dark. But you can leave it on. The website says for three months uh, on a single double A it'll burn like that. The uh, middle of the two uh, low modes is uh, it says it's 2.7 lumens and it'll run for four days straight like that i've tried this outside and you can actually walk around outside uh, with this especially in the dark dark a dark trail you can see pretty good with just the 2.7 lumens um, for those that need more light if you go to the uh, medium setting, the lower of the medium settings, this is a 12 lumen uh, setting. It'll go for 27 hours at that setting. And the uh, higher or the middle one actually is a 12 hour setting, uh, 25 lumens, which is actually painfully bright if you're running around outside with this. If you really need to light something up uh, for a short period of time, it has a super intense mode. Let's see if I can find it here. Low, medium, high. The uh, lower of the two high modes is 172 lumens, which will go for 1.7 hours. It's also got a uh, 180 lumen excuse me, a 280 lumen mode, which it'll go for about an hour, 0.9 hours is what the website says. Uh, I would never really use it at that uh, level, single click and it goes back off. I've been using it in its, uh, let's see, low, uh, you know, the lower or the medium setting or the high or the low setting. It's got uh, a strobe. Let's see if I can make it do that. If you click it, three times it'll strobe it's either three or four i forget and if you double click from there it'll flash very goofily you can fool your friends with that um it's pretty nice it's got a uh, fairly small body and it'll stand up it doesn't really it rolls a little bit uh, but you can stand it on either end it is waterproof. It is, um, it's got this ribbed uh, middle section with lots of ribs. And the head band, it's made out of silicone rubber. And they sell these separately on the web in case you break it, although it seems pretty durable. And these web, uh, these silicone loops just slide over the body of the light and they sit perfectly inside these uh, these ribs so you can now you can tip it up you can tip it down while it's on your head uh, it's very easy to adjust uh, that way so that's it I got a couple nighttime shots I'll splice onto the end of this to try and uh, 
demonstrate it more in the dark, but I think it's a pretty nifty headlight. I hope you uh, learned something from the video and uh, any questions or comments, post them down below. Uh, please subscribe to my channel and I'll provide links to the website, maybe some other information uh, down below. Here's a shot of the light in its very lowest mode. And you can see you can read with it and the camera can almost pick it up pretty good. And if I turn it up a little bit, uh, you can actually read very well uh, with that. Get an idea for how bright that is. This is the medium setting and it's fairly, fairly bright. Go super bright or blindingly bright. Get some focus on that. There we go. Super duper low. You can't even see it hardly. Um, and that's wicked high. Wicked high is like a spotlight beam. It'll really, really blind you. So that's high, that's one click less than high, that's medium, that's the lower end of medium, which I can see the house fine, but you can't. 